pagi. Oh, hi. Pagi, Pooh. Gladys Dunn. Hello there. Hello. Are you native of Westport? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that's my barn right over there. Barns fascinate me. I've always wanted to live in a barn. Why don't you? I have hay fever. Well, you can always take the hay out and keep mice. That's what I did. That's a fascinating idea. Yeah, well, I'll send you some mice to get you started. Say, you're cute. How's you get me a drink to get me started? Yes, ma'am. Let's dance our way over. Oh, no, I can't. I'm the guest of honor. Oh. Well, then, get me a martini. All right. Hope this is dry enough. <laughs> what is this, a lethal weapon? Strictly regulation, nine to one. <laughs> this one may do it. And if it does, I'm going to hold you responsible. You will? Mm-hmm. Thank you, Miss Poole. I feel a little dizzy. I think I'll go in and lie down. Oh, why don't you do that, Doctor? Uh, thank you. Run away. Welcome. You're somebody else. Hmm. It looks like she's picked Augie as the target for tonight. Well, you can't blame Augie. She threw herself at him. Yes, and she's got a lot more to throw at him than I have. And most of it's out in the open. It's a shame to see so much valuable space going to waste. She should be advertising something. She is advertising something. <laughs> the clinging vine type, all right. Well, I'm going to tell her to grow up on a wall or something and leave my husband alone. Darling, they're playing our song. What? You don't mind if I dance with my husband, do you? <laughs> 